Dear students, today I'm talking about paint tools in GEMB program. Let's start our lesson today. Paint tools are used for different drawing pictures, such as you can make free hand drawing like that, or you can create gradient color scheme like that. Also, you can merge the current color with the surround colors like that. At last, you can copy part of image in another place like that. Let's see how. On find menu, select new, choose the template 800 by 600. White, then press OK button. How can I access Paint Tools? I can access Paint Tools by two ways. From Tools menu, I choose Paint Tools. Then I choose the tool that I want. Then the program has 13 into tools, but I will study this here. Eight tools. What are they? Pocket fill tool, blend tool, pencil tool, paint brush tool, eraser tool, ink tool, clone tool. The last one is smudge tool. Also, you can access. As you see, let's see how can we draw with these tools. Let's start with the pencil tool. Choose the pencil tool, as you see, from toolbox. Then choose the color that you want. You can increase or decrease its size from size box. Then, then draw this shape. Let's zoom in. You noted that it has hard edges. It has hard edges, as you see. Zoom out. You can also, also you can use pencil to draw straight lines. Let's see how. Click at the starting point, then hold down shift key. And another one, click starting point, then hold it down the shift key, then complete the shape. You can color it from bucket fill tool. Choose the color. As you see. Also, you can choose type of brush. From the tool, options the tool. Let's see how. Choose pencil tool. You can choose the type of brush that you want, like 
star choose its color for example red pink increase its size as you like then drop this shape another type of brush you can choose vegetarian to color Paper, as you see, another brush can choose vegetarian one, as you see, can also increase its size, as you see. Another one choose it the color. You can choose another one and so on. Let's take another two. We use then the brush tool, as you see. And the brush tool is used to paint with smooth edges. It has it has the similar options of pencil tool. Let's draw with it. Choose paint the brush tool. Choose the type of this brush tool. You can increase its size as you like. Choose its color. Green. Then draw. Another type of brush. Change its color. Another type of brush. Choose its color. Let's know the difference between pencil tool and brush tool. With the pencil tool, through the brush, you notice that Brush tool, choose the same brush and the draw. The pencil tool and the brush tool. Pencil tool has hard edges, but the brush tool has soft edges. As you see, the blend tool is used to make color gradation from front color to back color. Let's see how. Choose the front color, as you see, then choose the back color, then from the shape. Choose fire as you see. Then from top to bottom or from right to left, 
or from diagonal, as you see. You can make the gradation shape as you see. Also, you can also you can choose another shape of the blend tool. Then drag and drop, as you see. Or like that, or like that. Can it choose spiral again, as you see. Let's take the smudge tool. What is the smudge tool? This is the smudge tool. A smudge tool is used to mix the color, the current color with the surrounding colors. Now, choose the smudge tool. Then it's choose the shape of its brush as you like. For example, a star. It shows increase its size as you like. Then mixing the color as you like. Click on the pull. To mixing the color. Let's take eraser tool. Eraser tool is used to delete color space of a picture or drawing. Let's see how. We use the fill bucket tool. Color my image. Then. Choose eraser tool, choose its shape, and you can increase or decrease its size from the size box as you see. Then erase as you see. You see that you can use eraser tool to draw as you see. You can use another shape. As you see, another shape, as you see, and so on. Let's take ink tool. You can use ink tool like a fountain pen. Let's see how you can choose the size of ink tool and you can choose the shape of it like a circle square or a diamond let's just choose a circle and increase its size and draw and see what happens and draw with it a cartoon shape, as you see. Let's take clone tool. Clone tool. Clone tool is used to copy part of the image in another place. With clone tool, you can reform the images. Let's see here. Click on clone tool, then it shows the shape of it. You can from size increase its size as you see. Then click image while pressing control key to make a copy of this image. Then move to the place that you want to paste this copy of image. Then click and pull to copy this version. They can hold until you finish the 
the COVID version, as you see. Don't lift your hand until you finishing your image. Let's draw with Jim the program. In this image, we want to remove this man from the image without affecting its appearance. Let's see how. We use to make that clone tool and the smudge tool. We use firstly clone tool to make a copy from this. Then press control while pressing the control to make a copy. Can they pull? They can pull until you remove this man. They can pull. As you see. Decrease the size of the brush. To remove the leg of this man. Then choose smudge tool. Use it shape and size. Then mixing the color as you see. So we reform. It's parents. To draw this image easily in GIMP program, use clone tool, then click and pressing the control key to make a copy of this image. Move to the place that you want to paste this copy, then click and then drag to draw this image easily. Don't lift your hand until you're finishing this drawing. As you see. And the end of this lesson, goodbye and good luck.